one, Categorous. the PS One uh, Resident Evil. Apparently, we, our version is the one that has the has real the worst soundtrack. They changed it because the original apparently originally had an uncredited ghost composer, and for copyright reasons, I guess they had to have like the actual composer like whip up something in a hurry. And it's some of its tracks are really bad. One of them is like I'd say Xenoverse Two bad. Like, the instrumentation is just baffling. I mean, there are other bafflingly bad things in the game, so it's fine. The dogs did not hear that. Neither the explosion nor the ya. They're not very good at their job. Wow, science guns are. Oh, the dog just looking around the other one like, what the hell, man? Shh, it's a stealth mission. You're not stealthing very well. You're mostly shooting dogs. With the stealth gun. The people of Bethesda just want me to feel sad. Well, in the apocalypse, dogs exist. I'm sorry. Yeah, but in the apocalypse, evil people use dogs to do evil things, just like in real life. I don't like thinking about sad. The apocalypse is a sad place. I mean, that, I feel it's true. Come on, there has to be something beneficial in this dungeon. Not just dead people with ordinary clothes. There, a dead prospector! Who has useful stuff. Leather armor, that's good. Hey, Boone, give me your armor. I'm gonna I'm gonna glue some more armor to it to make it better. Help, Boone, I'm fat! <laughs> Fine by me. <laughs> oh, I see. We're carrying some other junk. By me. Just a second, you need to take your clothes real quick. Thanks. I'm washing them by gluing them together. <laughs> it's only my computer farted because I muted the sound right then. <laughs> Is reinforced leather armor unique? I don't think it is. But I want to be completely sure, because I'm going to glue it to this armor, if so. I'm guessing not, but let me load it. Leather armor, comma, reinforced. Oh, it actually seems better than our lightweight leather armor, which makes sense. Well, then repair it instead. The lightweight leather armor is unique. They're both light. I think it's where the non-unique one is actually worth more. Oh, the light armor? Yeah, the light armor is worth less, but it's unique. Well, you could go put it away. I probably will. Instead. Any word on the status of reinforced leather armor? It doesn't call it unique. All right, well, whatever. I'm I'm gonna keep it. It'll increase our weight by five, but it'll increase our DT some too. Especially because we're always carrying four suits of armor. It seems. I guess I could just give the lightweight to Boone and have him carry it. Fine Is by it me. better than what he has? Uh, probably not. We're gonna get, actually probably giving him the reinforced combat armor, which is worth a ton. But hey, it's it's fine to give your buddies good stuff, right? Yeah. He equips automatically whatever is the best for his loadout from yes. what I understand. We'll let him keep his beret, because it's iconic. And he may not switch out of it if it's yeah, look at him. scripted a certain way. He looks like he looks like a trooper man. A sniper sounds like the kind of guy who'd wear medium armor, doesn't it?
Oh, I can't repair them because one's in too good of condition, that's why. Yeah, we definitely need to maybe stop by the house. Oh, here's the mayor's office. And I don't there don't seem to be any threats here. So we'll take we'll start stealing some soda. Oh no, I'm fat with soda. That's like a real thing. Let's what can we get rid of? We'll drop these throwing... I don't know, throwing spears are worth too much. Just toss... Th machetes. Machetes aren't worth a lot. Fragmine? Heck no. I don't know why we're carrying a cowboy hat. Or a ranger hat. There we go. We're still pretty chubby, though. Oh, we, we need to increase our strength, too. Oh, for your weapons? Yeah, and for just carrying capacity. Oh, damn, fat with cigarettes? Oh, I'm fat with dog. That's it. Dog meat. They say he's not in this game, but he is. Well, it is. Tool cabinet? Oh, it's just Wonder Blue. Ammo! Money? Ow! Hit myself the door, as is customary. Big Book of Science! Double Programmer's Digest. Oh! There's Stain's Terminal. The people of Nipton were actually also were corrupt, which the Legion uses to justify their actions. It hardly been my luck. Literally, I'm agape. Just now, I was approached by a rather in... This is the mayor's office. Intense young man calling himself Mr. Fox. Yeah, right. When we were alone in my office, he let me know that he is a member of Caesar's Legion. He knew the NCR troops and powder gangers often spend time in Nipton. It turns out that the Legion hates and wishes to make an example of both groups. The NCR for obvious reasons, and the powder gangers for harassing Legion raid raiding parties on this side of the river. I had time to think a moment before Mr. Fox is about his proposition before accepting it. All I have to do is convince the powders to kidnap the NCR troops at night. When both groups are in town, the Legion boys will scoop everyone up. Ha! For this simple task, I have been offered 8,000 caps! I can almost go back to the NCR right away. But who knows how much else I might make off this Legion lackey. I'm going to start stockpiling some supplies in a safe house between here and that Mojave outpost. Just in case I decide to head back home in a hurry. Very exciting. Signed with a steady hand on the keyboard. Super Mayor Joseph B. Stein Three, the third Esquire. So basically, hey, it's a Stein. S T E Y N. He agree. Basically, Mister Fox. Basically, told him that if he, he could get the some NCR members and the Power Gangers all in one spot for the Legion to capture, he get paid. And he agreed to it like a scumbag. And for being a scumbag afterwards, the Legion also killed him. Public publicly tortured him to death. So they had their own justice. It's just that they're also lawful evil. So it was a sting, though, because he they also convinced him to do it. So yes. actually, it would be considered duress. Um, it would be uh, um, what's it? Uh, there's a term for that where. Entrapment, that's what it is. They set him up to do it. But yeah, if you actually do talk to the legionaries here, they'll tell you about it. But we had Boom with us, so we just killed it instead. 
Alright, what else do we have in here? Future weapons today. Energy cells. A bubba -pur. A lotter oh, lottery tickets. From the evil lottery. They weigh nothing, so I guess we'll just take them. Yeah, anything that's weightless, just take them. Let's read this big book of science to increase our science by three. Forever! Should I look for if there are any repair books nearby? Uh, books seem a lot more rare in New Vegas, but they're also three times as potent. I don't think it's necessary. Leather armor! Let's see just how many there are in the game. Uh, enough, just not as many. Oh, yep, I found the loot room. There are more Big Book of Science than any other book in the game. That's weird. There are five. I mean, it's not a bad thing. It's weird. Yeah, five. There are like ten or so in Fallout 3, I think. But they're all a lot weaker. Gun cabinet. Ammo. I'll take all of your ammo gladly. Not taking the dynamite, because a stick of dynamite's worthless, pretty much. In battle or for barter. Also, any time you find a workbench, look in the crate next to it. On occasion, they will randomly have a book in them. Randomly? Yeah. It can random, hold random skill books. Yeah, it can hold a random skill book. Specifically, verbatim, can hold random skill books. <sighs> hmm, well, I don't know if they randomly spawn, but... Alright. There are 16 crates in the game. And there's one by every workbench. Let's put some leather in the leather. Dean's Electronics is the name of the repair book, and it's the least common one. That's just lovely. Hey, <laughs> tiny, tiny babies. I forgot we had that book that you cannot read. Um, there's one at Nellis Air Force Base. Might as well drop this submachine gun. One at the wind farm. I found a scorched book. I don't know what it's in it though, because it's, it's scorched. And yes. And one at Sloan, and then three in the DLCs. Really, the DLCs give you more skill books? Yes. Maybe there are two in Dead Money, I one in Lonesome Road. I almost. Oh, we need to get all the ones in Dead Money then. Yeah, because you can't go back. I can tell you the. Areas like the places of that'll do. Dead money books. That'll do. We'll do it once we get look at that once we've gotten started with dead money because yeah. it has a bit of a preamble. Oh hey, what do you think, Boone, about what we just did? What is it? Oh, we we could drill him more for him for the longest wife, but that's. I don't think we should pressure him. You know. Yeah, I don't think it affects. Yeah. The and if even if even if it does, it's it's not very nice of us, you know. He's still grieving, obviously. And why shouldn't he, right? I'd like to open this door. Why can't we just break the door down? Like just shoot the lock. Sure, we don't have the strength to break it, probably, but we might because this door is hundreds of years old. But why can't we just shoot the lock out? With a with our Revolver. Like a rock star. Alright, let's head back to, back home to deposit some stuff. Not that we can take it with us, anyhow. Oh, let's head to the gun runners to do some shipping. Yeah, some shipping. You gonna write a fanfiction while you read it? Yeah. Must have been the wind. Yeah, super mayor. Hello, potential customer. Welcome, sir or madam. I am. Yeah, he has a lot of money. Let's sell these lottery tickets because they don't do anything.
Let's see.